Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the fridge. On the menu tonight is Tom Clancy's The Division. This is going to be the first in a series of videos as we take a new character uh, through the storyline missions. Let's skip this intro and head straight to uh, customer creation. Customer creation? How about character creation? Given that I've skipped the introduction of the game, I'll give you a little rundown on what's happening here. It's a fairly simple premise. Some bad guy makes a new strain of smallpox, uses the Black Friday sales to spread the infection in Manhattan. Panic ensues, government shuts down the island, it all goes to hell in a handbasket. We are sent in to get the situation back under control. Right, now that I've finished that, let's get on with the tutorial. Intelligence system analytic computer is activated. All ISAC systems are confirmed online. To cover at the marker to begin weapon verification. Weapon test initialized. Cover fire at the highlighted targets. Primary weapon test successful. Weapon test initialized. Open fire at the highlighted targets. Sidearm test successful. Welcome aboard, Agent. This is Louis Chang, Northeast Section Commander of the Division. You have been activated because Brooklyn has become dangerously unstable. Isaac has updated us with your progress. Proceed to the nearest safe house for your full equipment loadout. Agent, I've confirmed that your fellow agent, Faye Lau, has arrived here. Check in with her when you get inside. We're losing this whole neighborhood. Rioters are moving through, in force, and headed this way. Put your people there. I see someone else got the call. I'm Agent Fei Lau, Division. Activated at the same time as you, part of the second wave of us going in. I don't know what happened to the first wave, but unfortunately, there's still lots left for us to do. We don't have much intel, and we don't have the luxury of failure. Not with Manhattan under lockdown and Brooklyn on the brink. People like me and you. We're what's left to hold the line. With any luck, we'll have more to go on once we rendezvous with the commander. More about the situation, about who's turning the streets into a war zone. Anything that's going to help us do what we're supposed to do. And if you'll excuse me, Lieutenant. Officer Hazen and his team are handling situation reports. If you're looking for a hot spot, that's who you want to talk to. Complete your activation at the terminal to enable Directive 51 operational status and equipment. Identity confirmed. SHD equipment activated. This is our gentle introduction to the combat system of the game. Yep, one bloke. Can't get much more gentle than that. This seems like a good time to use a grenade. Area secured. Hostiles neutralized. Hostiles neutralized, huh? Well, that's one way of putting it. Morning. Hostile forces approaching. I noticed I was given an item, so I open up my inventory and equip my new vest. 
This is the introduction to the skill system in the division. Here I choose for myself the sticky bomb launcher. The skills here use the skill power stat. So the bomb launcher's damage is dependent on that skill. The higher the skill power, the higher the damage. Agent, we've got word of a hostage situation at a bank. Looks like you'll have to go through the subway tunnel to access the building. We need you to move in and minimize the damage. Morning. Hostile presence detected. I moved through the subway, came up here through the manhole to uh, start this mission. Come on, what you got in here? It seems like a grenade would be a lovely opening move here, don't you think? Here I'm using the map to find my next mission and to set the navigation Agent, to it. Those rioters have stolen a crate of morphine. Probably gonna try and sell it or use it. We've got people in real pain who need those drugs. See if you can recover that crate. The radar in the top left of the screen gives you an indication of where the bad guys are and just how close they are. That little manoeuvre is firing from cover. It's much less accurate, but it limits your exposure to incoming fire. Here I become overconfident, fail to check the radar, and it's going to cost me. Yes, I died, and no, I didn't edit it out. There's no real death penalty in this game, so just get stuck in and have fun. Getting word they're planning on trading hostages for drugs. 
you need to get in there, eliminate the threat to the precinct, and free any hostages. Next time we shall run through the precinct siege to complete our tutorial objectives and begin the storyline. Thank you for joining me again in the fridge. On your way out, please poke the like and subscribe buttons, and I'll see you again soon.